ए बी बी सी 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 डी 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 ई ई ई ई वॉट इज द वन ट्वेंटी एथ लेटर इफ यू लुक एट द सीक्वेंस फर्स्ट टर्म कंटेन्स वन टर्म सेकेंड टर्म कंटेन्स टू टर्म्स थर्ड टर्म कंटेन्स थ्री फोर्थ टर्म कंटेन्स फोर फिफ्थ टर्म कंटेन्स फाइव टर्म्स सो द ईजियर वे वुड बी यूजिंग द फॉर्मूला ऑफ सम ऑफ फर्स्ट एंड नेचुरल नंबर्स एंड दैट इज गिवन बाय द फॉर्मूला एन इन टू एन प्लस वन अपॉन टू दिस गिव्स मी द नंबर ऑफ टर्म्स अप टू अ सर्टन टर्म ऑफ द सीरीज लेट्स से इफ आई वॉन्ट टू कैलकुलेट द नंबर ऑफ टर्म्स अप टू द थर्ड टर्म सो आई राइट एन इज इक्वल टू थ्री नाउ put this so this would be 3 into 4 by 2 which is 6 let's count 1 2 3 4 5 6 six terms till the third term so i hope this formula is clear to everyone what we'll do here is we'll try to go as close as 120th term using trial and error so we can use different values for n so we can use n as let's say 13 why we have put n as 13 because we see it starts from the option being m n o p 13 14 15 16 so we started with n being 13 so number of terms would be simply 13 into 14 by 2 which is 13 into 7 91 terms we are not very close yeah we are close to 120 but i feel we can move a bit closer to 120 so again we'll use another value of n let's say this time we use 14 so number of terms is 14 into 15 by 2 this is 7 15 into 7 is 105 terms now what do we know by this or what do we have from this it means if we look at the 14th term 14th term is n so till 14th term n would be 14 times and if we start from a b b c c c and we go up to these many terms we have covered 105 terms now from 106th term onwards we are starting with n equivalent to 15 and n equivalent to 15 is simply o now o will be contained how many times o will be contained 15 times so if we add 15 to this it would be 120 so exactly 120th term or any term from 106 107 108 going up to 120th term any of these term is a o so option c is our correct fit here now if i ask you what would be the 121st term so here we have exhausted 15 and we would be starting with 16 so 121st term would be p 122nd term would be p how many times 16 times and that is how you can solve these type of questions I hope this help take care bye bye keep practicing and you can see we have done around 3 questions on these type of sequences and everywhere we are focusing on the application of this formula